And this has been part of the Stimulating Physics Network link that we've had with the IOP. Um, so this has just been one aspect that's really involved our students into a new, a new thing that we've not done before. Um, I really like all the practicals yeah. and the way that we like took all the big experiments they do to find out about other planets and kind of put them into like classroom experiments. I think it means that they, they, they can see the relevance of, of what they learn in physics to all sorts of different situations and see the sort of the, the broad applications of it. Well, I always found it interesting, um, but sometimes lessons were less interesting because we didn't do the more interesting things such as looking for plants. The chance really just to, to explore different things that they might not come across until sixth form, like we, we do a lot of work with the spectroscopy and looking at splitting up light with diffraction gratings, and it, it just gets them the chance to, to look at all different things and look at how it links to a, a simple problem. Um, so when you shine a green light, the colours that um, are shown in the spectroglasses are mainly blues and greens and this bit of yellow. Whereas when you hold up the reds, it's mainly from the red side of the spectrum, so you just get reds and oranges and yellows. Um, whereas if you hold up white light, like our Becca's doing, because it's white light, it has all the colours of the spectrum in it, so you get all of them, like rainbow. You see a little grey line on the spectrum, where the eye view like, absorbs some of the colour. And also we think about what we would do more, rather than just like getting knowledge that rather than just being told knowledge, we kind of think about what we would do in a situation. And I think we reflect on it more with the blogs than we would in a normal lesson. Yeah. Let's go onto their own blog, they've put on videos of what they've done, discuss what they've done. Um, it's really a good chance for them to reflect on what they've done, but then the, the sort of the mentoring side of it um, is they have a link with the sixth form in other schools. She comments on what's on their blog. They like the fact that she looks at what they've done and she gives them more extra ideas and so on. So there is that support. It's given them a much broader view of how many different aspects of, of physics can be brought into something like um, the search, in this case, for extrasolar planets. But yes, I think it's really enthused them.